This is the Wildcat Piper coming to you from the walk. Wait a minute. This isn't the Wildcat Lounge. I told you I was going to go on a trip to visit one of my good buddies, Jesse Allison. And that's where we're at today. Mountain Prevail Knives. These are knives that are made by uh, Jesse. We're going to talk a lot about that today. I'm going to show you why I actually came down here <laughs> was to pick mine up that uh, he, he, uh, did for me and i want to show that to you and then i'm going to have him talk a little bit more about that and then we're going to tell you about the giveaway first of all i'm smoking this is kind of a knockoff um oh, what do they call those knives that uh, um, north north uh, northeast northwest piper smokes yeah uh anyway it's a knockoff I one of those <laughs> yeah it's a knockoff one of those and in it i'm smoking some uh Hearth and Homes Marble Cake. And I had that on my, actually on my very last video and I really like this stuff. What about you, Jesse? I am smoking my Il Dagner that I've had from a few years ago when those guys uh, put this one out. And in it, my very favorite, Colt Blood Red Moon. Colt Blood Red Moon. I love this stuff. Now, if some of you older fellers, or as far as the years go in uh, the YTPC, um, would remember Jesse, from uh, his previous channel, to, and that, that channel was Appalachian Axe Man. That's what I used to call myself on the on the for the YTPC. Yeah, and I remember he remember I was jealous. I don't know if you guys remember his uh, the the little um, his garage or his workshop. I was jealous of it, and I kept telling him that <laughs> about how jealous I was of that workshop that he had. Um, but he's he kind of went away for a little while, and uh, and now he's back. And uh, Jesse, tell us what you're doing now. And uh, so uh, since since the Appalachian Axe Man days, I, I had a whole lot of stuff go on in life. Nothing bad, just, just busy changes and stuff. And uh, ended up selling the place where I was at and moving on a little further out in the country and uh, didn't have a shop or nothing. So I built this new place. And uh, as far as what I'm uh, work-wise and what I'm doing for hobbies and which is now full-time is, you know, the, the Axe stuff, the, where, where the Axe Man thing came from is they used to do a ton of axe restoration and and whatnot and uh but i uh, got into to making handmade custom knives and stuff and uh yep so that's what i've dove head first into here and, and uh, this is a knife that he made for me this is his uh bushman knife yeah the, or the bush crafter bush crafter i'm sorry and uh look at that and you can go to mountainprevail.com uh, or uh, Mountain Prevail on uh, on YouTube, and he'll step you through his process that he does uh, with his knives. Here's the sheet that he made. It's got blue. I don't know if it picks it up, but it's got blue um, stitching in it. And I don't know if you guys could tell on on the pipe here, but it's got uh, a blue spacer in there, and. Um, the it's, it's burl what's um, the wood the, uh, the handle the, the blue is a it's a just a thin strip of g10 and the wood is a curly maple it's stabilized of course i stabilize it here in-house and, and i tell you i just i just love it I, I i came down here and i i liked it when i saw it uh on the on the, um he showed pictures of it to me i liked it then but uh coming down here and actually holding it and getting to, to shape it. I really, really like it. And he, 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 Jesse, you go through an extensive process to uh, all to heat treat and different things yeah, with the uh, blades. Yeah, because yeah, I, I get the steel, you know, well, you know, raw steel in here and I cut them out and profile them, heat treat, do the grinds, uh, make the handles, and, and just every, everything happens right here in this little shop. And uh, yeah, that was what. Uh, where I kind of gravitated to on my YouTube channel is doing more shop stock shop type stuff and uh, as far as my more of more day-to-day -day stuff or and not as much pipe smoking stuff but yeah uh, yeah and uh, uh, I gotta get I gotta get a little bit more back into that thank you. yeah he said he kind of got disheartened with all those regulations came out I think a lot of people did actually 
with all that. It kind of turned a sour yeah. to it. And, that's, uh, that's when I was really into it the most is when all that stuff happened and it kind of just disheartened me, I guess, a little bit. Yeah, and uh, so, but I'm glad he's back. Uh, I always enjoyed uh, his channel, um, The Appalachian Axe Man. I enjoyed watching it. Um, he, I him think when you hit it off, uh -huh. right off the bat, when we, we started about the same time. I think I even did a... Uh, you did a shout out on my channel. I did a shout out on yeah. your channel, yeah. and we just kind of we just kind of became friends just like that. And then today, I got to meet him face to face for the first time. Got to meet his wife and his beautiful little baby boy, and so uh, it's it's been a great trip for me. And I'll be headed back tonight. But one of the things I told you I wanted to do was I want to do a giveaway, and it's mainly just to get traffic to his his channel and uh, to get people going to it. I mean, you you, I I am a knife guy. I love knives. Um, I look and dream of the big the big expensive knives that you see on on uh, different channels and things. But I tell you what, there's none that are like this right here, and. Um, he, he pours his heart and soul into it, as you will see on his YouTube channel, just like the guy driving by there in his truck. Uh, <laughs> we are up in the mountains, but uh, you will see how, how in depth he goes to with, with, uh, with these knives. And it shaves, just in case you're wondering. I, I, he shaved his arm, I shaved mine <laughs> with it while he was out running around, because I had to make sure. And, uh, but they're, they're exit nice. So I'm wanting to get traffic to his channel. So one of the things I'm wanting to do is to do a 10 tobacco two pipe giveaway to people. All you have to do is go to his channel and subscribe. And, um, then we will, uh, the, how long do you want to, what you want this to go for? At your call, man. I'm, uh, I see what's today's um, July the 18th. So let's do four weeks, okay? So we'll go to August the 18th. I don't even know what day that is. But we'll go look. to, yeah, look look and see. I can look here real quick. But we'll, we'll do four weeks. That should give everybody plenty of time. Hey, go go get your friends. Let's just, let's show him what the YTPC can do and let's just swarm his channel and uh, get a lot of people to go and to uh, sub sub to him. Yeah, August 18th, it looks like it's on a Tuesday. It's a Tuesday night. So August the 18th, Tuesday, um, we'll do a drawing and all you have to do is you have to be a subscriber to Mountain Prevail um, Knife uh, with Jesse Allison and um, and then uh, once that Tuesday night comes on the 18th we'll draw and then one person will take home 10 tobaccos and and two pipes the, the uh, one of the pipes is is a corn cob what was your favorite one the gen uh, the general is that yours the country gentleman. Country gentleman. Think, yeah. And then I'm also going to do a uh, corn, a cob, a freehand, and because uh, those are the larger, the larger ones. Um, I really like those. My favorite is probably the country gentleman, but that that uh, I really enjoy those too. If I can get my hands on a Dagner cob, I will order one myself and throw in the, the little poker style. Yeah, the poker that style. That was always my very favorite, but yeah, been a little scarce. Yeah, there, it's kind of hard to get those right now. But I did see where he just put out. Um, a bunch uh, that people could go get, but I'm sure they're probably gone by now. But if we can get a hold of, of a Dagner Cobble, we'll do that, and um, that, that'll give you guys an opportunity to get that as well. But um, ten, uh, what were your your five favorite? Now, just minus that one because I can't find it. Okay, so, um, number number one was the Colt Blood Red Moon. Colt Blood Red Moon. Uh, Trout Stream was always one of my favorites, and and. 100% hands down, man. Sleepy Hollow. Sleepy Hollow. We both love that one. Yeah. And uh, I, I can't even remember. It's on my phone. I yeah, can tell I, you because he, he wrote them down. If, yeah, go to the one of the yeah, messages you sent me because you had those on there. Um, but it, it'll be those. And then I've got five more, and I, I couldn't tell you what I, I've got um, uh, for that. So, um but it, it'll be it'll be a tin tobacco giveaway along with two pipes, maybe three if we can get one of those Dagner pokers because he enjoys those as well. But um, lane one Q, lane one Q, yeah. yep, I've yeah, got yeah. I've got that too. So um, so we we've got all the tobaccos. Uh, we I've just got to get that one pipe in. As soon as we get that in, then that'll that'll it'll be in by the 18th. But go to his channel, subscribe to it. Uh, 
above all though blow some smoke rings in the air and be blessed what was your sign off oh key oh, i know what it is yeah <laughs> <laughs> Hey, let me tell this real quick. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm glad you're going four weeks with the giveaway because, yeah. uh, like I say, things have been nuts crazy here, busy. But that'll give me some time. I'm, we're literally working right now on getting shirts, hats, stickers, and uh, probably going to make a ton of mountain trail some leather keychains out of scraps and stuff. So hopefully, before the giveaway's up, I can send the local bill here a handful of stuff. Yeah, to, we'll, uh, we'll throw, throw that in, in the box. We'll throw in with it. So yeah, we'll, we'll throw we'll, it in the box. Whatever we can We'll get. spice it up. Yeah. I've even got, I've still got some um, wildcat tampers I'll throw in there. Oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll throw those in there. So, uh, but you guys have a great day, and uh, we'll let we'll let Jesse send us off here. Yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and until next time, y'all keep them sharp. Keep them sharp. <laughs> Talk to you soon. Bye now.